of you as sort of the rebellious bunhead, um, which makes sense. So will be will we see any more rebellion from you? Oh yeah, a lot more rebellion. Um, but rebellion in sort of a more grown up way. Um, a lot of the things Sasha did before, she was doing for attention, and now I think it's more to figure out um, where she is in her life and like how she, what kind of adult she wants to become. Um, and she gets to rebel with Roman, who's her new love interest, and um, she gets to lean on Michelle, who's kind of rebellious in her own way. She's unconventional, she's quirky um, as well. Sasha's kind of like a young Michelle. She is, and I think um, I think that's why they identify with each other and they get along so well. Now, speaking of Michelle, things ended kind of weird for her, and you know she's on on weird terms with the parents after macing everybody. <laughs> How is that going to affect things going forward? Um, well, we don't know if Michelle comes back. We don't know when Michelle comes back. These are the questions, people. Um, it's going to affect it affects definitely all of the dynamics um, because. Michelle was really sort of a guiding light for these girls, and she's just like ripped away from them. And Fanny, too, is completely, um, you know, it's like they kind of lost a piece of their heart, as corny as that sounds. Uh, now, we, last question. We are in the 25 days of Christmas. Um, do you have a favorite Christmas movie that you always have to watch? When I was little, I didn't watch that much TV or that many movies. Like, I wasn't really allowed to, so I would always watch The Grinch. Um, and it scared the crap out of me, but I would watch it anyway. Um, so I think I'll probably watch The Grinch. Jim Carrey's a scary guy. He's a scary guy. And uh, what's her name? Taylor Momsen is a little girl. That's so cute. Now she's all grown up. <laughs> <laughs>